Papa. No. Uh, <laughs> wake up, Papa. Shop was the only way I could make it up to Papa. The business has been in the family for years before I came along and screwed things up. I'm no butcher, not like my father was, but I just can't let him down again. Every step along the way, things kept on getting worse. I was about to be evicted. By the end of the month, I had to repay this massive debt with only enough money for one more shipment of meat. So my two cousins, Kieran and Cran, offered their help to the shop, taking time away from their mortuary practice. These guys always meant business, bottom line, and that sometimes meant trouble. I was about to find out would change everything. He told me that because my mom died while giving birth to me, that I would destroy the shop once it was in my hands too. I'm going to be a good son, Pa. I'm going to be a good son to you. I'll do anything for you to accept me. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. 